your job. Nice. So, well. also, I wanted to ask, especially to the fans, what can we expect to the franchise in the next few years, maybe? Well, we, just like we did with Mortal Kombat 11, we're going to release a second part with more story. You know, there's, and we have a big surprise after that. Big um, so surprise. we're going to be supporting the game for uh, even longer than we did with Mortal Kombat 11. So it's, it's going to be fun. So we can't expect Yo, what's up? It's Dynasty back again with another MK1, MK Uno video. And yeah, Ed Boon is currently at CCXP23 in Brazil. And he's dropping bombshells. Now, obviously, the Quan Chi and Chameleon trailer just dropped today. But Boon talks about Peacemaker. Uh, confirms Eagly will be part of Peacemaker's gameplay. Confirms that Peacemaker's dropping after Quan Chi. Talks a lot about Quan Chi's gameplay, kind of, sort of. But I think the big takeaway from this is what you just saw in the beginning of the video. He confirmed the story mode expansion that got leaked. Uh, the day the game came out, mentioned some big surprise. I think he meets Combat Pack 2 plus a story expansion. But regardless, I'll be reacting to Ed Boon's panel here at CCXP23. If you want to see the full thing, I'll have it linked down below in the description. But if you're excited for some more MK1, take a second, do me a solid, drop a like on the video. I want to say thank you to everybody who's showing the love and support. On the videos I dropped today, my Quan Chi reactions already been uploaded, my breakdown as well. And if that's not enough, we gotta watch this together. So, without further ado, let's see what Ed Boon had to say about MK1 at CCXP 23. You can fit anywhere, you can do. Perfect, thank you. Ed's it's so fit. good to see oh, you here again point. in Brazil. It's been like two months since we first met. You yes. came to the to the Mortal Kombat One launchment here in Brazil, and it was so good that you chose Brazil to be and this Shout huge out Brazil, launchment man. that you had in this Come to Brazil. Months. So I'm really happy to see you again. Shout out Brazil. Yeah, I, I, so every every time I come to Brazil, it's louder than the last time I came, yeah. <laughs> and I've been here like five times, five or six times. So yeah. I, I always love coming here. It's always great. And you just passed through uh, Stage Thunder, right? And you had a great interview in there. I was seeing through live streams because I was like in the other part of the event. And I saw that you showed a lot about the Quan Chi gameplay. So I wanted to ask you if, what, what can we expect Quan about Chi. the Quan Chi gameplay? Specifically because we saw something about it in the story mode. So how, what can we expect now in, the, in this new launch? Yeah. Uh, this is a brand new Quan Chi. Brand he new. doesn't play like the story mode, he has much more moves, he has, he's, Tentacles. everything he does is kind of like a uh, magic, a sorcerer. So he's, he kicks into portals and then you see his leg come yeah. out of another portal. And he's very much, um, a lot of the characters are from Mortal Kombat Deadly Alliance mm -hmm. and Deception and Quan Chi is where, you know, part of that group. So we're very excited to get add him to the, to the mix. And what can we say about the backstory now that we have a different backstory in Mortal Kombat 1? What can you tell me about this new backstory? Well, this Quan Chi is actually featured in our story mode. So yeah. as far as but but his gameplay is brand new. <laughs> so Cap The leaked bio says he was he was a, a mine worker. I don't think that was ever in any previous Mortal Kombat game, but Boone's just like, eh. He was actually in the story mode. Boone, you're funny, man. Instead of just going into depth about the Quan Chi uh, childhood in the mines, Boone's like, if you played the story mode. Um, we're really excited the fact that, uh, <laughs> She really wanted to know some, some new lore on Quan Chi, and Boone's just not going to give it. We have both the Deadly Alliance the characters can choose Shang Tsung or Quan Chi. Yeah. Um, so it's really, um, we really felt like it, 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 we, we needed both characters in the game. Yeah, perfect. And we know that Quan Chi is not uh, the only new character coming with this DLC. We also have Chameleon. Chameleon with a K, because we have two versions of Chameleon. So That's why right. this version of Chameleon? Right. right. Chameleon is basically, everybody seems to love Kitana, Melina, and Jade. You know, those are the, the favorite uh, female characters, and Chameleon is a combination of all three. So she keeps changing 
um, you'll see in the in the reveal video, she keeps changing between them, and she has moves from all of them. It's uh, she's maybe the craziest cameo character we've had in the game. Yeah. When will she be available, Ed? And when will we be available? Um, I believe um, Quan Chi, Quan Chi is like with the fourteenth of December. Oh look, it's Ed Boom. When you go on main stage and they can't get your name right. Boone, if I was running this panel, I would have got your name right. I'm sorry. Within the next week or two. Nice, um, okay, and then, next week. And then week. maybe like a week after that, a uh, chameleon will, will be available. Yeah. Okay, I think Diego is not as happy. I think chameleon drops in uh, January. That's all we have. No, no official date other than January. Now, right? Yeah, I'm really happy. And also, we have another character, right? We have Peacemaker. Yes. Yeah, there was, was a going little... to be played by John Cena, right? Yeah, at the, at, the, at the very end of our video, we had a, a, a peek at, at Peacemaker, and John Cena is doing the voice of it. Woo! That's awesome. Um, That's awesome. Yeah, How yeah. Did well, that he, he does. He does everything from the TV shows, that crazy dance. He does the, um, <laughs> you know, uh, Eagly is in it, and all of the um, everything you expect from Peacemaker. Yeah, and talking Dope. about dance, I saw some pretty nice. Cannot wait to see uh, that gameplay via the data mines. Apparently, different helmets will be the arsenal, the meta for the character. So, uh, Peacemaker will swap his helmets during his gameplay, and plus, Eagly will be part of the moveset as well. So, yeah, exciting stuff. Nice moves during the trailer. So, I wanted to ask you about the tags and abilities of Quincy in this new story now. Yeah, every every attack he does is kind of based on magic. So he's kicking into portals, and you see his leg coming out another portal. I feel like Boone just set this. And he's doing, uh, you know, he's sending out like octopus arms <laughs> at uh, his opponents. Octopus confirmed. These tentacles. And um, so it's, he's not like a typical brawler. He's mainly um, all sorcery. Everything's sorcery. Oh, that's so nice. Nice. And Ed, I know that Van Damme was always there uh, inspiring the game, and now finally Fuck. we have him here. Yeah. I mean, congratulations. Was that a personal victory for you to get him in the game? It was. Um, How did that happen? I can only imagine the emails that you have to do to yeah. get him into the game. Yeah. Um, 30, over 30 years ago when we made the first game, um, you know, it was, it was four people working on the game, right? And so I can see how Van Damme, you know, four kids in their 20s yeah. say, we're making a game, do you want to be in it? He's going to say, no, nah, I, don't, I don't think so. Um, but then over 30 years, Mortal Kombat got bigger and bigger, and they made a movies and everything. So then when we asked him finally in this game, he said, yeah, I'll do it. Nice. That's really good. Well, it's... <laughs> they make movies and everything. I love you, Ed. You're hilarious. It's become a tradition to have guest characters in Mortal Kombat, and I want to know, when did you realize that it could do that? Because now we have multiple realities, but it wasn't always like that. When did you guys decide that, well, maybe it's time to bring some guest characters? Nice. Oh, that's a good question. Um, Mortal Kombat 9 is when the, the first one. I think we did um, Freddy and Kratos from God of War. In Mortal Kombat 9, And yeah. um, so that the response to that was so big that we knew that that was something we were going to be doing from on. And a lot of it is we're, we're just, you know, we're still in our heads, we're still 20-year-old kids who just want to see who would win in a fight, Rambo or Spawn or Predator or Alien or something like that. So it's, that's where it comes from. It's really good that you're bringing a lot of characters from other medias and doing... We know why this little crossover in the game it's pretty nice and it's still about peacemaker when will we will he be available i'm sorry when he will be available. i believe peacemaker is after quan chi after quan chi yeah yeah, yeah. so so he's uh okay. like, like i said he's, he's he's a lot of fun he, he does all these crazy dances he's yeah. he's a little like Murdoink, if you watch this, I need you to to get a green screen of Boone dancing like Peacemaker. If I can go back to that, that was hilarious. After Quan Chi. Oh, watch after Quan Chi. Watch yeah. the dance yeah. moves Boone's so, got. So he's, watch. Uh, okay. like, like I said, he's, he's, he's a lot of fun. He, he does all these crazy dances. Oh, 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 he's oh, he's oh, oh. a little like Johnny Cage. He's our a co comedic. They're There's a lot of comedy fit. in there. Yeah, They're yes. super fit. They could be best friends in there. They're super fit, she says. No. <laughs> you can you can make a word when they are best friends. And also, Chameleon will be available after him too. 
Chameleon will be available? Oh, yes. Chameleon will be available about a week or a week, two weeks at the most after Quan Chi comes out. So we want to release on a, on a pretty steady, steady basis. If he comes out on the 14th. And he said two weeks at the most. I'm going to call a cap. January is not two weeks after the 14th. Unless you're using the uh, the official date for everybody outside the combat pack. But I guess maybe. It's really nice that you launched the game like two months ago. And we already have those, all those new features. Yeah. And this new media, Trevor, it's so yeah, nice yeah. that you're always gonna, bringing new things to the game. And we're going to work on the game for years to come so we'll be nice. releasing more more story will be coming so a lot of uh, a lot of yeah because it was a more really story. important moment for the franchise as like at all because you basically rebooted it all you know you you did a whole story again so you have a lot of opportunities to put new things and new features and new characters so and i also wanted to ask you about this reboot what does it matter to you like what does it mean to you to reboot this whole franchise? Because it's 30 years of work, and now you can like rewrite everything. What does it mean to you? Well, like you said, it's 30 years, 11 Mortal Kombat games. Yeah. 12 if you count Shaolin Monks and everything. So we've done a lot of... And each time we raise the stakes, a more powerful villain, more... And we, we felt with Mortal Kombat 11, we hit the, the top, and we told this 30-year-old story, so let's start all over and reboot but keeping familiar characters that yeah. that players recognize and now ed after van damme after all those crazy guest characters do you have another dreamy character that you wanted to see in mortal kombat in the future oh, yeah yeah you, you know we're, we're always making plans for characters that are going to come out a year from now so we have a few of them Any in the spoilers? works no. Look at his Not face. Look at his face. <laughs> Not his spoilers. I, I just um, wanted to show you something. I would, I would get in so much trouble. Can I, with can my I ask him? <laughs> can I ask them to see who yeah, they like? You know, like Gente, quem vocês querem ver no próximo right Mortal Kombat? Grita aí. Quem vocês querem ver? We have a lot of options because everyone oh, has yeah. a different option of what they want to see in the next Mortal Kombat. And also, it's a huge movement to, for you to <laughs> sign this MK1 oh, yeah. Kombat. They they didn't ask him anyone that was mentioned. By the way, <laughs> what a, what a what a tease! Like exactly. it's a huge huge thing. I'm really happy to see that everyone here seems to like a lot of the franchise, and it's nice that we are in a pop culture event and we have a lot of things for entertainment in a lot of ways. And we still have a lot of game fans here, and especially Mortal Kombat One fans. Because your work in Mortal Kombat 1 was really amazing. I love the game. I played the game, I think, two days after we met during the event. And it was huge. It was amazing. And it's my game of the year, to be honest. I really enjoyed it. The story is amazing. Everything you did. And it looks amazing. Like, the graphics are really amazing. Congratulations yeah. on this new job. Nice. So, well. also, I wanted to ask, especially to the fans, what can we expect to the franchise in the next few years, maybe? Well, we, just like we did with Mortal Kombat 11, we're going to release a second part with more story. You know, there's, and we have a big surprise after that. Um, so we're going to be supporting the game for uh, even longer than we did with Mortal Kombat 11. So it's, it's going to be fun. So we can expect more story. That's so nice because okay. I really love the way you, t you tell the story of Mortal Kombat. And this, I really like the story mode and how you did with that and how you managed to make it interesting. And everything looks really good. Thank you so much for your job. It was amazing. And thank you so much also to the yeah. huge public we have in here. Exactly. I'm so excited for the new features. There's so many people here. Like, look at this. They're packed like fucking sardines for Ed Boone. Ed Boone is a rock star. Of Mortal Kombat, we have a lot of fans here, and it's really nice. Everyone, this guy has a steel book. Is it steel book? It's really cool. Really nice. Okay, Ed. Now that you came to Brazil, those many times, do you have a favorite thing in here? Because I can only imagine that you're almost turning yourself into a Brazilian right now. <laughs> no, my my favorite thing by far is the the fans the people the energy you know they they brazilians hits different they, they absolutely we love them too they, they energize us to do more to do better you know it's 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 
Twelve dollar fatalities, by the way. Like no other place in the world. Yeah, definitely. We are like so loud, and we can see it in literally every fan. People here are so loud every time, and so warm, and you know, you can feel the the love that they have for you. I hope so. Do you mind if I go off script for a while? Would you do the get over here? For for just for you guys, get over here. Just for us guys, I love this. Thank you Thanks. so much. Thank you so much. I think we're finished from here. Thank you so much and congratulations on your Thunder stage in there and your lease interview. Congratulations on your new features in Mortal Kombat 1 and as a launchman as it all. Thank you so much. Thank you so much thank for this interview. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you everybody for supporting Mortal Kombat all Fala these aí, galera. years. Mais uma salva de palmas pro Ed. There you go. That was the interview that Ed Boon had at CCXP23 with uh, Omelet? I, I don't fucking know. I love you guys, uh, but there's your confirmation. Some story DLC coming soon. Big announcement, surprise after that. I'm assuming it means KP2 because it's already been leaked. Uh, with some guest characters. Ghostface. But we'll see what happens, but guys, that's all I got for y'all today. What do you think of this interview that Boone had today, the day that hit the Quan, got released? What do you think of Chameleon? What do you think of everything? Let me know if you enjoyed. Take a second, drop a like on it. Of course, subscribe for more MK content like this on the channel. Till next time, I've been your host, Ben Dynasty. Guys, please take care, stay safe. I love you. See you in the next video.